Hi, my name is Brittany Porter, and I'm the Museum Tech and Conservator for Lincoln and Fort Stanton Historic Sites. Today, our From the Vault video comes from Lincoln Historic Site. This month, we are featuring John Tunstall because he was killed 143 years ago on February 18, 1878, igniting the Lincoln County War. Tunstall was a prolific letter writer and kept his family in England abreast of all his activities in New Mexico. His letters, many of them written using items carried in this case, are some of the most significant sources of information related to the Lincoln County War. This case was carried by him throughout his travels in Europe, Canada, and the United States. According to the inscription, Tunstall received this case in 1869. The state received the case in 1963 from Elise Weiderman, who inherited the case from her father, Robert A. Weiderman, who was an associate of Tunstall's in Lincoln County. Until early last year, John Tunstall's writing case was on display in the Anderson Freeman Visitor Center here in Lincoln. The Farm and Ranch Heritage Museum in Las Cruces has requested to have their writing case on loan for their upcoming exhibit, Writing Herd with Billy the Kid, The Rise of the Cattle Industry in New Mexico. The introduction of the exhibit states, Cattle made men money, money made men powerful, and power led men to use violence. Billy the Kid's brief but violent career as a cowboy and hired gun occurred during the Lincoln County War, a bitter feud over control of the state's cattle industry. While Billy the Kid is the headliner of this story, the exhibit will feature many other colorful characters, including cattle kings, a cattle queen, merchants, and cowboys who doubled as enforcers or regulators. Be sure to check out this exhibit when museums and historic sites are able to reopen. In order for objects to be loaned to another museum, they must first go to the Conservation Department for evaluation and recommendations for their display. It was no different for the writing case. Senior Conservator Maureen Russell did the evaluation of the case. In conservation, you are concerned with the stability of the object for both travel and display. When being evaluated, the case was found to have some corrosion on its brass buttons and that the leather straps are worn, breaking, and fragile. These issues are consistent with the age of the case. It is recommended to not manipulate or put straps back into the buckles to prevent further deterioration. Marine was able to clean the case and stabilize the corrosion on the buttons. The case is safe for display in a covered plexiglass vitrine. Conservation of the objects we keep is important so that they are around for generations to come.